In Hollywood, it's all about the baby bump right now, whether it's Tori Spelling expecting baby number four or first timer Jessica Simpson. A lot of stars are having babies and they're setting new trends when it comes to bringing home that bundle of joy. Here to talk about some of those latest trends in uh, babydom, everything from push presents to gender cakes and dachelor parties. All right, that's uh, mom and parenting blogger Beth Feldman. Good morning, Beth. Thanks for being with us. Good morning. Thanks for having me. You know, as women and moms, we always sort of dream up and try to come up with creative ways about telling our husbands that another one is on the way. What are some of the most creative ways that are kind of trending right now? Well, it's really an exciting time because now more than ever, you can find out that you're pregnant before you, you know, ever before, it's so soon. And so with, with a dad, you can actually give them a Father's Day card. With first response, they have a pregnancy test where you could find out six days before your missed period that you're pregnant. So you take your pregnancy test, you put it in the card, you open it up, and this is a memento that they're going to want to share forever. Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> All right, so now that you've told your husband, how do you tell the rest of the world? One of the things, of course, I've been seeing is Facebook. Now, is, is, is that the way to go? Post it on Facebook well, and tell the world? Well, you know what? It's something that people are just conditioned to sharing now. They share everything. Right. People even change their profile picture on Facebook to show the pregnancy test. You can tweet your lines uh, on Twitter, and then when you go for the first sonogram picture, you can pin it on Pinterest so that the whole world can see your baby. So, so how are couples celebrating uh, bringing home their brand new baby? Well, this is a fun one. There's there's a new thing called gender cakes where you yes. can go to. <laughs> it, it's hilarious. You go to, to get to find out what sex you're going to be having. You tell your your technician, don't tell me. Seal it in an envelope. Bring it to the bakery, and then th what you have a party. And when you slice the cake, you find out if it's pink, it's a girl, and if it's blue, it's a boy. And as you oh, can see over here, that. we're having fraternal twins. <laughs> <laughs> well, one of each, you know, I, I don't know that I would want to wait that long. I think I, I'd be like, all right, just tell me now, boy or girl. I, I know. <laughs> hey, before we let you go, there's still a lot more tips out there. and This is always a fun topic. Where can uh, moms and dads go for more information or more ideas in case we're planning a baby shower for someone else? Well, go to firstresponse.com because you want to find out from the very beginning how to take care of yourself and your baby. And there's some awesome great in information about all the trends that are going on right now. Sounds good. Beth, thank you so much for, for joining us this morning. Some great tips out there. Thank you. Yeah, I like the, uh, the cake. The don't tell me? Are you kidding me? I like me? the cake. Having that envelope <clears throat> in your hand and like, don't tell me? Don't open it. How do you not open it? You put it away. <laughs> you give it to me, I'll go hide you it. You know, I'm those people. <clears throat> give it to me. Like, You'll never see it. For birthdays and Christmas, they have to put like a do not peek until your birthday thing on I it. Was thinking, I, I was about to think that you were going to say that to put it in a closet, lock it with a padlock. Find it. I find it. I found my husband's Christmas gift for <clears throat> me in the garage. <laughs> Coming up.